Oh, there they are. <sighs> hey, Gohan! Took your sweet time, didn't ya? <laughs> Sorry about that. Man, this place sure is packed, huh? Yeah, no kidding. Pretty annoying, huh? Yeah! Oh, yeah! Yeah! It's Mr. Satan! Look! Mr. Satan's here! Mr. Satan, huh? <laughs> Looks like Earth's Heroes has shown up at last. <laughs> Hello to all my touring fans around the world! Are you ready? Popular, huh? Uh, it's Mr. Piccolo! Piccolo! Have you seen my dad anywhere? No. No sign of him yet. Gohan, uh, I have to ask, are you really going to wear that? What could be taking Goku so long? Maybe he's already in the waiting room. <laughs> hey, guys! The Evil Wizard Babadi's Machinations. Goku! Hey! <laughs> wow, you guys sure have changed a bunch. How have you all been? Goku! It's good to have you back. Goku! <laughs> Goku! Goku! <sighs> Dad! <laughs> huh? Look, Goten, it's your father! Whoa! That's my son? Wow, he looks just like me! <laughs> What's wrong, Goten? There's no need to be shy. His name's Goten, huh? I like it! You've got 24 hours. That's it. Thanks, Fortune Teller Baba! This is as far as we can go. Break a leg out there, guys. Thanks. We'll catch up with you later. See ya! Hey, Goten, wanna do some exploring around this place? Yeah, that sounds like fun! Let's go! Alright, let's go check out what's going on over there! Mom's 
might be looking for us. They're not gonna let us buy anything if they're angry at us. Uh, I know. We'll say you got lost and that I was looking for you. Yeah, that should work. What? I'm the one that got lost. That's how it's gotta be. It'll be more believable for me to look for you since I'm older. All right, peace. <gasps> hey, that's not fair, Trunks. Wandering around. What? Uh, how'd you know? Goten, you just gave us away. That's what I thought, Goten. It's rude to lie to people. That's right, Trunks. You're older and you should know better than this. We're, We're sorry. sorry. All right, that's enough of that. Let's head to the arena. Right. If we don't hurry, there won't be any seats left. You ready, Goten? Yeah, I'm ready. We will soon begin the selection process! It looks like this is the biggest turnout we've had in years! But only the best 16 of you will have a chance to compete! Since the returning champion, Mr. Satan, will automatically be allowed to compete, that means only 15 of you will be advancing! Let's find out who that'll be! To keep things fair, we'll be testing everyone's strength with this punching machine! Those with the 15 highest scores will be selected to fight in the tournament! Punching machine? What the heck is that? Let's see if any of you have what it takes to beat our champion, Mr. Satan's high score! We're expecting some great scores! Now, let's begin the World Tournament Selection Round! Good thing we did all that training and made it through, huh? <laughs> Not like there was any worry there. Hmm? Greetings. You must be Goku. Huh? How do you know who I am? I've heard of you before. May I shake your hand? Sure. Uh, nice to meet you. Just as I'd heard, you have a good spirit. Huh? Now, if you'll excuse me. What? Who the hell was that? I'm not sure, but, you know, I'm starting to get the feeling that this tournament's not going to be a walk in the park after all. Everybody here looks like a pushover except those two. Hmm. What's with those guys? They look kind of weird. Like they're more powerful than they should be. So the world tournament was finally underway. Most of the Z warriors were spread out across the matches. However, Goku and Vegeta were fatefully paired against each other 
for the sixth match of the first round. Krillin set the tone for the tournament by making short work of his opponent in the first match. In the second match, Piccolo found himself standing before the enigmatic Shin. However, <sighs> what is this? What is going on? Why am I having such a hard time with this guy? This isn't right. Who the hell is he? You'll find that out soon enough. Let's just enjoy the game for now. <gasps> Count me out. I forfeit. Huh? You forfeit? You're not going to fight anymore? That's right. I see. So he's the former guardian of this planet. Perhaps he's realized who I am then. Well, let's keep things rolling! Time for our third match! Next, it's Videl versus Popovich! Correct me if I'm wrong, but uh, you're not... Uh, not what exactly? Uh, you're not the... Uh, the Grand Kai, are you? No, I am not. He's the Supreme Kai. Green Kai! Please keep that to yourself for now. I don't want others to know just yet. So, you're even higher than the Grand Kai, who's above the four Kais. I mean, I'd heard about gods above the Kais before, but I didn't know they actually existed. Hey, Piccolo! Something wrong? Don't tell me that guy's already talking trash. You want me to have a word with him? No, go! No, keep your mouth shut. Do not say anything, you hear me? Huh? Meanwhile, Videl was trading blows with the muscle-bound Spopovich in the third match. Though Videl was a much more capable fighter, she was quickly overpowered by Spopovich's abnormal strength. I put my finger on it, but there's something seriously off about that guy. Like he's not using his own power. That monster! You gave it your best! Tap out! Just throw in the towel, Videl! Uh, no! Wait, I, I'm not giving up. <laughs> That's it. I've had enough. That jerk's going down. Hey, now. Okay, come on, take it easy, Gohan. No! That's enough, Spopovich. You've had your fun. We came here for something far more important than this. Hurry up and win the match. Yeah, okay. Jill. <clears throat> Spovovich! <sighs> You're not gonna get away with this. You hear me? Should I call for a stretcher? No, I'll carry her myself. You got it. 
If I win my next match, I'll be up against him in the fight after that. Go on! I've got some sensu beans! Thank goodness. Fidel, you're gonna have to trust me on this. But could you eat this bean? Anything from you. Probably has some mysterious power behind it, right? Yeah. You should be fine now. But it'd be best for you to take it easy for a while here. Thank you, Gohan. Gotta go. Everyone's waiting. found himself facing the mysterious Kabito in the fourth match. Transform into that Super Saiyan form of yours. I want to see if you truly have what it takes to help our cause. Huh? How do you know about Super Saiyans? And what do you mean, help our cause? You will find out soon enough. First, I want to see the power of a Super Saiyan. Uh, are you kidding? I can't just transform into a Super Saiyan in front of everyone. Hmm. I can't hear what they're talking about. He told Gohan to transform into a Super Saiyan. Gohan! Piccolo! What's up, Piccolo? You know what's going on? Uh, I'm not sure, but... <sighs> Our apologies, but Gohan will be assisting us with something for the time being. All of you must promise that you will not get involved, no matter what happens. I trust I can count on you. Uh, what? Wait, what do you mean? You honestly think we're just going to do whatever you say? Tell us who you are! Uh, he's, uh, the Supreme Kai. He rules over all the Kais. He's a god. Uh, oh yeah, that's right! King Kai told me about you. So you're the Supreme Kai. Huh. Alright, I'll transform into a Super Saiyan. Not sure why you'd want me to, though. Why don't I take it one step further and transform into something beyond a Super Saiyan? Take it to the next level. What? Beyond a Super Saiyan? <laughs> this energy's incredible. That's our guy. He... he transformed! Gohan transformed! You've got to be kidding me! We're taking that energy. Make sure he doesn't try to escape, Spopovich. Right! There! Who are you? We've got enough energy now. Let's do it! Wait! Don't move! Not yet! He'll be fine. Kabito will restore his strength shortly. I intend to follow those two and learn where they're taking Gohan's energy. If you wish to join me, 
You are more than welcome to do so. I could use your help. So, what are you gonna do, Goku? I'm gonna go with him. You heard him, didn't you, Krillin? He could really use our help in this. Besides, I have to know what this is all about. Uh, then I, I guess I'll go too. I don't think so, Kakarot. Did you forget about your match with me? Uh, come on! This isn't the time for that, okay, Vegeta? Don't blow me off! The actions of that supreme whatever aren't my concern in the slightest. All I care about is settling the score with you once and for all. That's the whole reason I joined this stupid tournament in the first place. I hear ya, I hear ya. It doesn't have to be here, but we'll fight later, I promise, all right? Idiot, you're only back from Otherworld for one day, remember? Hey, you should come to Otherworld with me. We can fight there. <laughs> Let's go. Tell me, can I really trust you with Gohan? It'll be fine. After I finish healing him, I will be joining you. I'm sure he'll follow soon thereafter. We have much of a chance without your help. Much of a chance? You mean against those two guys? No, not those two. They're merely pawns. At the beck and call of an evil wizard. A, a wizard? Yes. Right around the time mankind began to walk upright here on Earth, an evil wizard named Bibbity lived in a distant corner of the universe. One day, Bibbidi happened to create a terrifyingly powerful monster. That monster was Boo, an untenable and fearsome Machin. In a few short years, hundreds of once vibrant planets were reduced to nothing but ashes. Majin Boo's power was so great that even his creator struggled to control him. Bibbidi had no other recourse but to temporarily seal Majin Boo away. I was able to use that chance to defeat Bibbidi, however. I failed to realize that Bibbidi had a child. His son Bobbidi, who was filled with just as much evil as his father. There. You're healed, Gohan. <sighs> wow. I feel great. Come with me. I will tell you everything. Can I come too? There's so much I want to know. Please? Can you just promise me you'll run if things get dangerous? Sure. All right then, let's go. Majin Buu, huh? Wow. Okay. So, then, what were those Spopovich and Yamu guys doing at the tournament? In order to break the long-held seal on Majin Buu, a large, pure energy source is needed. Those two were sent to the tournament to gather that energy. We won't be able to reach the others at this rate. We need to increase our speed. I can't fly any faster than this! Okay, you'd better head back then. Things are far worse than I feared. Guess I'm gonna have to, huh? That's too bad. But I think I finally learned something. It wasn't my dad that beat Cell back then. It was you guys, right? 
Well, uh... I knew it. I thought something was off when I heard my dad beat him. That clears things up. Good luck, Gohan. Pulverize that wizard Bobbity and save the world. Right. Don't die on me, Gohan. I want to go on a date with you when you get back. Are you done? We need to hurry after the Supreme Kai. Right. Sorry about that. I wonder what this Bobbity guy's like. Okay, let's go meet up with my dad and the others. My dad and the others. Someone's down there. Do you think it might be that Bobbity guy? No, that's not Bobbity. Someone's coming out. Dabura, curse that Bobbity. He's made the king of the demon realm nothing but his servant. Huh? Dabura? Which one's that? The big guy? Yes. Wait, so that means... The, the, the little one over there is the wizard Bobbity? Correct. What he lacks in physical strength, he more than makes up for with his terrifying magic. Babadi's greatest technique is his ability to latch on to the evil in one's heart and use it to bend the victim to his will. For this reason, only those such as ourselves, free from evil in our hearts, will be able to fight him. Oh my, this is completely full of energy. Well done, you two. This brings us closer to reviving Margin Boo. And it also means I have no more use for you. Pui Pui! Yes, sir! <laughs> well, my dear Deborah, it seems that Yamu and his friends have brought us some visitors, <laughs> just as I calculated. And with them, that infernal Supreme Kai who murdered my father long ago. Assuming we can't make use of the energy for the Supreme Kai and Kabito, three of the others appear to have more than enough energy for our needs. Once you eradicate the others, Deborah, I want you to then lure those three into the ship. 
That will afford us a much greater chance of absorbing their energy. Indeed. One more thing. Do not kill the Supreme Kai. I will personally see to it he receives a slow and painful death later. As you wish, Lord Bobbidi. Do not let me down. Sir. Now then. It's time. Kibito! <gasps> no! <coughs> what the? Uh, uh, oh no! <coughs> Krillin! Piccolo! Don't touch them! They've both been turned to stone. They can't be restored unless Dabura is killed. Oh, is that all we have to do? Well, that seems simple enough. Leave this place! You will never be able to stop Lord Bobbidi. Let's go! Where are you going? Dad, let's make short work of this guy and save Piccolo and Krillin. Whoa, what is this place? Well, this is an awfully plain room. Be on your guard. We don't know what kind of traps they have in store for us. Now that I think about it, it's rather strange that you three weren't attacked at all. My apologies, but we're not the sit around and do nothing types. Lord Barbady is on the lowermost floor of this ship. Unfortunately, if you want to go down any further, you're going to have to go through me. So... In other words, this is where you all die! <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't be so sure of that. So who goes first? I think rock, paper, scissors would be fair. <laughs> Fine. All right, guys, here goes! Rock, rock paper, paper, scissors! scissors. <laughs> rock, rock, paper, scissors! Rock, paper, scissors. Oh, man. Good! Looks like I'm up first. Uh, are you really going to fight him alone? Of course! I'm more than enough for this worm. <laughs> You're dumber than you look, you know that? Like I said before, you guys aren't getting past this floor. Any damage you take here will be converted into energy and absorbed by this room. And then sent directly to the ball that Majin Buu sealed inside. That's good to hear. Does that mean if I blow you to pieces right now, no energy will be absorbed? That's right. But unfortunately for you, that's not gonna happen. Enough talking. Let's hurry up and get this over with. Come at me. Oh dear, I can't have you damaging my ship. <laughs> What the? Whoa, what just happened? Where are we? Bobbity used his magic to change the room, most likely to a place that benefits his henchmen. So what? <laughs> I'm going to end this quickly. I was just about to say that myself. <laughs> Yeah. 
yourself! Big Bang! There is tip time stronger than Earth's! This is where I was born and raised! Doesn't he have goons stronger than this? Huh? Hey, check it out! A hole opened up in the floor! It looks like some sort of elevator. Uh, how... how did you do... that? What gives? 
This room looks just like the last one. Whoa! This guy looks pretty slow. That's that's Yakon! Demon Beast Yakon! In the interest of time, I'll transport you to your beloved home world of Darkstar and its pitch black environment. Make sure to retrieve plenty of energy for me. <laughs> now which one of you should I eat first? You're up against me! My first call! It's my turn now!
still follow your movements. Things like changes in airflow give you away. This is what they're throwing at us. Then this Majin Buu creature must be a real weakling. Huh. What in the world are these people? I know what to do now. 
I shall handle these intruders myself. And in doing so, I should be able to retrieve more than enough energy for Majin Buu. But Debora, if I lose you, then I'll have no further defense against them! Do you actually stand a chance? Stand a chance? <laughs> I am Debora, King of the Demon Realm. No one in this universe has the power to defeat me. <laughs> <laughs>